welcome to this video where I'm going to be showing you how to skip the puzzles in Soggy Cave. I'll be doing the daily trial, but not really, because I'll just get the obsidian chest and leave, because I'm just because for some stupid reason I decided I wanted to be high armor with exact chance, but whatever. But I'll just show you how to get the and we'll get to the puzzles or whatever. I'm sure I get to skip the puzzles because the whole point of this video is not to get puzzles because I don't like puzzles and for sure. Many people also don't like puzzles. Okay, here we are. So there's one out of two chances, or two different layouts you can get for this door. One's easier than the other, and a lot easier. And we got the easy one. Although I clicked on the wrong door, I already know what it is. So this one, all you have to do is go over here. Uh, you're gonna go up here, oops. And then you're gonna feather to that corner over there. I screwed up, unfortunate. So I'm just gonna have to fall off. And I'm probably going to get assaulted by mob right now. Yes, I am. And that one has killed That is not good. Well, I got across. I can roll over here. And unfortunately, this is the only room where we have to do a puzzle. But it is extremely easy. We just go like this. And just go back and forth. It's not really a puzzle at all. And there's uh, the alternate version of this room. Which is actually harder. But you don't have to do a puzzle, but you have to do an extreme jump, so that sucks. But let's see what we get for this room. I think there's like three different things you can get for this one. No, two only. Yeah, there's only two also. So, what you want to do is get a feather, go over here, jump onto that. And then you're going to go over here, and then you're going to jump across here. Make sure you're not like, because you can actually be under this gate even though it's not open or like it doesn't show, it's still there. So you wanna make sure you're above it. So like right here and then jump over here. And then you're gonna jump past those three brick things. I'm not sure what they are, but you're gonna jump to the corner over here. And then you're gonna go over here, walk across here. You wanna make sure that you hit like the little thing that makes it, or that makes the game think that you did the puzzle. And it's just by like walking across here for some reason. Let me just do that. And then jump to this corner over here. And then from this corner, go over the bridge. And let's see if we did it right. And as you see, the door's open now. And we just said screw you game. Oh look, the armor I was looking for. How can we get it? And it does not have the enchantments they want. But as you can see, I found... Yeah. I've just been grinding beehive armor for some stupid reason, I'm trying to get uh, beehive armor with wait, what's it freaking called, tumblebee, and that one thing that makes your pets explode and cooldown reduction. I have no idea why, I just thought it'd be funny. But uh, while I was doing that, I figured this out. Now we're going to go ahead and redo this and see if we get the different room layout so I can show you guys how to do that. So let's go back in there and hope we get the different layout although I will say out the on uh, or will say that the other layout for the first door is absolutely I hate it so much well it depends if you want to do the shortcut or not it is because there's a because you know um, for the other layout there's a mob gate or whatever and you have to fight all the mobs or we can do is you can go to the other door and then like try to throw yourself across the thing just to skip the mob gate but if you suck at it I think it's literally easier just to do the mob gate thing and just do the, but then you can still skip the puzzle afterwards but technically the fastest way is to throw yourself across the room and then skip the puzzle but uh let's see if we get it I'm kinda hoping that we can, but I also wanna show it so let's go ahead and we'll get back to the cave area thingy I'm 
my guy got yeeted. Okay, here we are. Let's see if we get the different one. Uh, no, we got this one again. Whatever, I'm only just ready to get through it. And too late to edit my video, so I'm sorry. I'll try to do this as fast as possible. Ah, I screwed up, whatever. Button mashing. <laughs> <laughs> I screwed up on the easiest puzzle, that's sad. Anyways. Yeah, it's because I clicked the wrong one twice. Okay, let's see if we got a different one for this one. Because there's only two for each, so let's see if we got the second one. Oh, we, we got the different one for this, so you just want to go here. You can go off this corner and feather onto this. And what you're going to do is follow my movement, because you want to like hit like a little sort of invisible thing that tells the game that you did the puzzle for some reason. So we're just going to go here, kind of like rub against that, and then we're going to go up here, and over here, and over there. And just like that, we should be done. Yep. Pretty simple. Open this. Got a uh, cursed X. Interesting. Okay, now we're going to do this one more time, and hopefully we get the different uh, first door layout. And I'll show you how to do that. So let's go ahead and go back in there. And then we're gonna go ahead and speed run back to the cave. Okay, um, let's see if we've got the different layout. Yes, we did. So, this one, you can not skip it from here. But what you can do is we can actually skip it from going in through the other door. But I will warn you, it's pretty hard. So, if anything, you can just do this normally. And then you can do the part after to skip the puzzle, which I'll show you. But I'm going to do it the other way. So, we're going to go in here. And you want to have some sort of like muscle armor or something just for your roll because I think it makes it slightly longer or something, I'm not sure. But all I know is I haven't been able to do it without muscle armor, so I'm just going to go throw that on. And then we have to get like the right angle for this, which is really hard. And then you just want to roll. As you can see, I'm probably going to fail this a couple of times before I actually get it. So you just want to be as far on this edge as possible and kind of like turn down oops i screwed that up i shot for some reason uh let's do god damn it <laughs> this might take a bit extremely painful which is why i might recommend just to do this the normal way and i'm gonna show you how to skip the puzzle after i finally actually make it here if i do Ah, there we go, I finally did it. I need to swap back to my cooldown reduction armor. Make sure you don't fall off here. And you're gonna go up here, onto this. I'm gonna run across it a little bit. You know, just to make sure you hit it. Hit, like, the little invisible thing. If you're doing this the, the hard way, like I just showed you right now, I recommend running around this thing for a bit, because you do not want to do that again. It, it sucks. I'm gonna go over here, uh, across here a little bit, and then go over here. And then now we're gonna go to the other room. Ah, uh, it's this one again, so we'll just go ahead and do this again. Oh, oops. There we go. And now the gate should be open. And if it's not open, that means I messed up. Good thing I didn't. Okay, and that's how you do that to scuff the puzzles because, yeah. I even got a dancer sword. 
it's kind of whatever i guess but um yeah that's a video goodbye oh my god no <laughs> which is all I have. And go over here.